Hey guys, it's Quinn. Please click the like button so that the YouTube algorithm recognizes that I've uploaded and circulates my video. Thanks guys. Isaac Asimov's Foundation series was the first ever science fiction series to contain a full-fledged galactic empire. The entire series involves the centuries-long plan of a man known as Harry Seldon to restore the human galactic empire after a great crash which led to a dark age. Harry Seldon was able to predict the fall of the first galactic empire by the use of a form of mathematics known as psychohistory, which was able to predict human behavior over time at mass. Psychohistory. Gail Dornick using non-mathematical concepts has defined psychohistory to be that branch of mathematics which deals with the reactions of human conglomerates to fixed social and economic stimuli. Essentially, the empire fell due to the capital planet Trantor's inability to adequately handle the bureaucratic and administrative demands of such a large empire containing 25 million worlds. Harry Seldon's solution would ultimately prove to be extremely complicated and multifaceted, but it is presented initially as the creation of the Foundation. The Foundation would be founded on a distant world, Terminus, and would have encyclopedist whose job was to record all human knowledge in the universe, inside the Encyclopedia Galactica. Thousands of humans would devote themselves to the project in an effort to preserve the knowledge of all mankind, in the hope that doing so could shorten the interregnum which would follow the collapse of the Empire. All my project, my 30,000 men with their wives and children, are devoting themselves to the preparation of an Encyclopedia Galactica. They will not complete it in their lifetimes. I will not even live to see it fairly begun. But by the time Trantor falls, it will be complete, and copies will exist in every major library in the galaxy. Though it had been initially stated that the Foundation existed solely to create the Encyclopedia Galactica, it is revealed a third of the way through the first book, fifty years after its initial creation, that the Encyclopedia is not the true purpose of the Foundation at all. Harry Seldon had left a vault on Terminus. It was set to open on a specific date, in which the pre-recorded holograms of Seldon would appear to address the Foundation. The vault opens, and a hologram of him reveals the truth. The Encyclopedia Foundation, to begin with, is a fraud, and always has been. It is a fraud in the sense that neither I nor my colleagues care at all whether a single volume of the Encyclopedia is ever published. It has served its purpose, since by it we extracted an imperial charter from the Emperor, by it we attracted the hundred thousand humans necessary for our scheme, and by it we managed to keep them preoccupied while events shaped themselves, until it was too late for any of them to draw back. Harry Seldon tells them that the path for the Foundation is inevitable. They will be faced with a series of crises that he himself had predicted through psychohistory. He tells them that in each crisis they will be forced along a singular path due to the circumstances set in place. The paths they will take will be paths laid out in Harry Seldon's psychohistory calculations. As I said, psychohistory could predict human psychology at mass over long distances of time. As it develops over the centuries, the Foundation is met with crisis after crisis, just as Seldon had predicted. Each time his pre-recorded hologram appears to advise them. Later in the series, however, Seldon's plan is shaken with the arrival of the Mule. The Mule possessed powerful mentalic powers. Because of this, he skewed the results of Seldon's predictions. Because of the Mule, Seldon's attempt at preserving humanity was almost completely thwarted. The saga of the Foundation continues for hundreds of years and involves the struggles faced by humanity during the Dark Ages and the rise of a new human galactic empire. The main series in the Foundation Saga is considered a trilogy, Foundation, Foundation and Empire, and the Second Foundation, but there are actually seven books in total in the Foundation series, not including Asimov's Galactic Empire series or Robot series. Two prequels, Prelude to Foundation and Four at the Foundation, and two sequels, Foundation's Edge and Foundation and Earth. Asimov's Foundation is widely considered to be one of the most influential science fiction sagas of all time. Many of the most successful science fiction sagas ever, like Dune, Star Wars, and others, would not exist without Foundation. Thank you guys for watching. 
Make sure you like and subscribe for more Quinn's ideas.